Hello Umbrellas and welcome back to another movie commentary. In today's episode of the commentaries with Welty, that could be a thing. We're watching Narnia, sorry, The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, The Witch and The Wardrobe. What a name by the way. You may be wondering why we're watching Narnia today. There's no actually particular reason and I, I don't even know. I just think it looks sick from the thumbnail. I think I may actually have watched this once. I mean it came out in 2005 so I was a sperm cell when I watched this. Oh, we're in the clouds. Is there dragons in this? I'm pretty sure this is a mythical movie. I mean, they can't be planes, right? All right, well, we are 30 seconds in and I'm already wrong. Well, that's me humbled. Ah, uh, he's just admiring the bombage. Get away from there. What do you think you're doing? Hey, he's enjoying himself, woman. Wait, dad. Well, you just forgot your dad? It's a bit fucking selfish. Oh, a picture of his dad. Oh, his dad's dead, isn't he? Dad, where he wouldn't make us go. If dad were here, I mean, the war was over and we wouldn't have to go. We will listen to your brother. Oh, they're getting sent away because of the war. Oh, this is a real depressing start. Hold on, did you just reject your mother's kiss? Boy, this may be the last time you see your mother. And you treat her like that? That's this boy and tumbled. You know I like making jokes and stuff like that, but the stuff that we as a society take for granted sometimes. Ugh. They're off to the Hogwarts. They're on the Hogwarts Express. Yeah, wizard. I hope one of them's called Harry. What is that noise? Why are you so noisy? I nosy. Yeah, I'm gonna call you out. Yeah, do you feel embarrassed now? All the umbrellas are judging you now. Mm, so I thought, bitch. Professor Kirk is not accustomed oh to Oh my god. They live in the good life. Worst game ever invented. <laughs> we could play hide and seek. Oh, they play hide and seek. And that's where the wardrobe comes in. One of them hides in the wardrobe. It's too, ah, it's too easy if that's it. I was here first. Oh, okay, this boy is a dick. Is that the wardrobe? Wait, we are actually going to Narnia because of hide and seek. Really? Really? It's a wooden wardrobe. How are you so calm, little one? How is she so calm? Little girl, you've just came out a wardrobe into another world. Say something. Oh, is she gonna get lost though? How is she gonna remember that? There's a lamppost. Random. Have I actually just shot myself from a tree branch? Oh, has he never seen a human before? Nah, surely not. Surely someone must have known that wardrobe leads into Snowland. You must be some kind of beardless dwarf. I'm not a dwarf. I'm a girl. Oh, really? Why is this such a subtle conversation? How is this not weird? This is weird. Anya, <laughs> what's that? You're in it. <laughs> oh dear girl, you're, you're in it. Oh, what a surprise. Lucy Pevensey, how would it be if you came and had tea with me? Mmm, red flags. You've got to say tea and biscuit. Just tea? Red flag. Ice skating and, and snowball fights. <laughs> oh, and Christmas. Not here. You don't get presents? Everyone's so selfish in this world. She get drugged. My music? Wait, what's happening? Whoa! Holy fuck, you messed up, man. Such a terrible form. Huh? It's something I am doing. What are you doing? I'm kidnapping you. Oh fuck, well that's very straightforward. At least he's being honest, right? She may already know you're here. Even some of the trees are on her side. The trees? This guy is barking mad. <laughs> Go. Oh my god, he's so dead. We've actually had a redemption arc complete in the first 20 minutes of this movie. I think Lucy wants to play anymore. I've been gone for hours. What? 
Are they not worthy? Oh, her curious mind. She's gonna go back into the wardrobe and cause even more havoc. Like, girl, don't you know you've basically killed Mr. Thomas? See, how does she know it's there or not, though? Candle burn out. It is there. What makes it there or not? Like, can he see it? Or is it just her? Oh, not this little dick, man. Maybe he dies. That's how he gets humbled. Lucy. Why is no one freaking out? Am I, am I overthinking this? Like, just saying, if I went into a wardrobe and came out to a new world, I would believe I've lost my mind. Santa? Oh, that's the queen that wants humans dead. Holy fuck, it's a dwarf. Back in a moment. Now that is much better. It's like 24 degrees right now. And before all you Americans come and say, oh, 24 degrees, I could do that in my sleep. Scotland is not built for heat. We don't have AC unlike yous. Our radiators produce heat. It's like a sauna in here. <laughs> what is your name, son of Adam? Where are your eyebrows? <laughs> I'm such a hypocrite. You said you met some fawn called Tumnus. Oh my god, why are you telling her everything? What? He's basically just saying all of them to death, right? I can make anything you like. Turkish delight? Out of all things you said, Turkish delight? Ah, oh, this boy deserves to get bullied. I'm gonna miss you. The White Witch? She calls herself the Queen of Narnia, but she really isn't. Oh, they're both so dumb. I know they're children, but they're so thick. <laughs> you saw the phone. Imagine he says no. I shouldn't have encouraged her. But oh my god, he actually not. is. Oh, he has to die. I don't think I've ever hated a kid more. In the upstairs wardrobe. Oh, he knows. Oh, he knows. What did you say? He should tell all the family the wisdom of what he knows in Narnia. Well done, Ed. You bowled it. Her footsteps are so loud. <laughs> Isn't that a wardrobe door? Oh, what a coincidence. Oh my god, they're finally all gonna see Narnia. Ow. Okay, and it works now. I think maybe it's a certain time of day it works. No, oh, because she went at night after that. I don't fucking know. Why is wardrobe logic a thing? I don't have any. Hello? Oh, he actually is dead, ain't he? Lucy! Oh, it's because little bitch boy ratted him out. Tumnus is hereby charged with high treason. Go back. But what about Mr. Tumnus? He was arrested just for being with a human. Yeah, shit pussy. Take the pussy way out. Oh, I bet I can speak. I ain't gonna smell it if that's what you want. <laughs> yeah, I've done too many Barbie commentaries to know when an animal can speak. Hello, <laughs> nice cup of Rosie Lee. It's lovely. Now it's merely a trifle, you know. Why do people lie so much in this movie? No, it's not. Enjoying the scenery, are we? Nah, he's finally with betray. Oh, that transition though. But still, this little boy's a dick. This guy's going to betray his family. For Turkish delight. Not even chocolate. Turkish delight. Aslan is on the move. Right, who's Aslan? Can you give us context? Who's Aslan? Thank you. Why is Dick Boy <laughs> though? <laughs> and he's waiting for you near the stone table. They don't even know about the prophecy. What the fuck is ha what is happening? What that two sons of Adam and two daughters of Eve will defeat the White Witch and restore peace to Narnia. Well that is bullshit. Because right now there's only one son and two daughters. I'm not including Dick Boy. Ed. Oh my god, he's actually dipped already. I'm gonna kill him. Please, thank you. Oh, that's quite cool though. Do you think this is where Elsa got her inspiration from? You can't just let him go. He's our brother. He's the bite. Yes, you can. What are you talking about, dumb girl? His face is so punchable. Mum says how dare you come alone? Oh, you have anger issues, Missy. Do that. Oh, I did bring them halfway. They're in the little house at the dam with the beavers. Do you just want to rat everyone out? You 
have no sympathy? Do you have a brain? I'm freezing again. Honestly, this little boy has fucked me over. I'm so cold. Hurry, Mama! They're after us! Take them. Oh, that voice, though. How can a voice be so good? Who is that? Wait. I'm so sorry, dear. It was my best mate. Oh, they're not statues. Do you can actually freeze things? Here in Narnia. Now that's a valuable bit of information, don't you think? Ooh! Oh, that's rude. Smell them out. Oh, wow, that is a brave fox. No, I know how this seems, right? I'm telling you, the animals are the only thing I like in this movie so far. Not in that way. Not in that way you think of. The humans are so thick and dumb. There's no logic in their brains. Ah ha 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 ha! Is that for Turkish delight? I'm nowhere to be found. Which means death. The beaver said something about Aslan. He just doesn't know when to keep his mouth shut. Free. Nadia. You're here because he turned you in for sweeties. Oh, 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 oh. And she ain't wrong though. <laughs> but the way she said that for sweeties, she just made that sound so much worse. It's hard! Run! Run! Oh, we're gonna get fight scene? Oh my god, the shot. <laughs> Why the hell is that Santa Claus? Is this a Christmas movie? Dude, what the fuck is this movie? <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> will cure any injury. Trust in this bow. And it will not easily miss. Unless you're really skilled with a bow, that just seems like a random gift to give to someone. She like the Katniss Everdeen of Narnia. Oh, that has sound effect though. <gasps> Oh, the... Long live Aslan. Oh, I was so expecting a Merry Christmas then. And Merry Christmas! Oh, thank you! <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, don't! Ah. Hold on to me. What are you planning on doing here? Oh, this is epic, this music. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but is the dog dead though? I really hope not. Like honestly, I think I'm on the Queen's side here. Forgive me, Your Majesty. Battery. Not to seem rude, but I wasn't actually talking to you. You were talking to her. Oh, that was so badass. I mean, he doesn't deserve to be a king though, but that was so badass. I mean, this is- no! oh, My emotions are all over the place right now. Think about whose side you're on, Edmund. Oh, I don't know whose side I'm on. Mine? Man. Or theirs? Like, they're all dumb. Is there another side we don't know about yet? Can I be on that side? Plus as well, if you suffer from hay fever like me, you actually prefer winter. The Queen's just got more going for her. Are they all staring at us? They think you look funny. I mean, your forehead is quite big, to be fair. <laughs> He does look like an ordinary lion, to be fair, but nice. Welcome, Peter, son of Adam. Where is the fourth? Sucking off the queen. Anyway, the CGI in this is amazing. <laughs> this was made in 2005. I'm telling you, movies that came out in the 2000s look so much better than movies nowadays. Betrayed us all. Peace, Aureus. So he's our brother. But that only makes the betrayal all the worse. Animals make so much more sense. I'm not a furry. I'm spitting facts! Mum hasn't had a dress like this since before the war. We should bring her one back. A whole trunk full. If we ever get back. Mm, death could be on the cards. I hope. Please. so dead now. Like a dog! I mean, ain't no way he's dead, so he's just killed a dog. I wish it was a cat. 
Aslan's a cat. No, I don't mean like the genre of cats. I mean like a cat cat. A pussy cat meow. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm so weird. <laughs> Oh my god. They got through your defences that quickly? Isn't she supposed to be a queen? She should have the best knights possible. Ah, uh, I didn't like how easy that was to get Edmondson back. That should have been so much harder. Maybe someone should have died. Like if we saw an actual fight there and he saw with his own eyes the struggle they all did to rescue him, he would have felt so much more shit about himself, which is what we want. Mm. How good are you? Shit, apparently. Doors upon which Narnia was built. Do not cite the deep magic to me, which I was there when it was written. Oh! 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 I was there when it was written. That is one of the coldest lines I've ever heard. Every traitor belongs to me. That boy will die on the stone table. I don't hate it. <laughs> the law is the law. That's all I'm saying. You can't dis you can't disobey that. He has renounced a claim on the son of Adam's blood. How do I know your promise will be kept? <laughs> Oh, oh, uh, that, that's why, that, that, that is why, mm-hmm. Why is he sad? What's he done? Is he handed himself in? For him? There's no way. Is he walking to his death? Oh, oh this is actual depression now. Like, Jenna, not just because I hate Edmund. You're so much powerful and better in every way than that boy. That's such a stupid swap deal. Behold the great lie. I just don't understand why he's doing this. He's giving himself up for a boy who has never fought in his life. Unless he knows this boy has secret powers. Why? Only problem I have with this movie so far is, well, one, a lot of them are really dumb. And two, just, there's no context being explained with all the actions. Like, what's happening? <laughs> you little bitch. Oh, this is so sad, man. First, be shaved. Shaving his hair off. Have you no shame? He's a great lion. Where's the dignity? Oh, oh I think she just ejaculated. No, I'm a little disappointed in you. Ah, fuck you. Albino ball bag. Oh, that was too well done. That was just so sad. Oh, I'm such a hypocrite. Like, I always ask. I always want death in movies. Because that makes it less family friendly. And gives the character and story arcs motives to progress. Well, that was just done so well. Like, that's just so sad. Oh, why couldn't it be the fucking dick boy? And they've just left him. Like, he's a piece of garbage. Still, my princes. I bring grave news on your sister. Oh, that is so cool! The witch's army is nearing, sire. What are your orders? <laughs> I love how he just took total command of the whole army when all he's done is kill a dog. <laughs> oh. oh, this music, this shot. Oh, my arse is clenched! <laughs> Wait, what is that? Wait. It just looks like humans in a green screen. Fun fact, the Scottish national animal is a unicorn. Nice. Oh, this is unreal. What are you gonna do up there? <laughs> oh, this is just so epic. Oh, I'm honestly about to bust a nut. Don't do it. It's gonna go loud. Hmm. Okay. I'll use a still there. Wow, use a really good help. It's nice to know that arching practice went to good use. What was that shot? 
No. He's not just came back alive, right? Oh, I don't know if I like that. Oh, I just, I feel like such a pussy now. I was so sad earlier. Oh, fuck you for coming back alive. Committed no treachery, is killed and a traitor stared. The stone table will crack and even death itself would turn backwards. So why did you act so sad then? And why is the queen so dumb? Why am I surprised everyone's dumb in this movie <laughs> apart from the animals? <laughs> so awesome like see if i get to see just some death that they don't come back alive in this is a top tier movie Stop! <laughs> oh this is so good <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who you are, but if you kill the queen, I don't care. Oh, so he only got teleported. Oh, so he's not, so he's not dead at all. She is flawed. Like, I imagine there's a way for the statues to come back, because I imagine Mr. Thomas isn't dead. So every time, technically, she's going in for the kill. She's not actually going to kill them. I'm sorry, her crying is actually just so funny. <laughs> so him breathing brings them back to life. Yep. <sighs> oh! Oh! There's no coming back from that, though. Peter said, get out of it. Peter's not king yet. <laughs> That's true, that's true. To be fair, if there's anyone I think should kill the Queen, it is either him or Aslan. How did you miss that? Oh, you're so pathetic. Oh my god, never mind. Oh my god, he's dead. Okay, 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 come on now. <laughs> don't don't be too cheesy on me now. <laughs> this music. No, actually, you just can't read. <laughs> Literally, it said it on the stone. There was writing around the stone. <laughs> like, you've only got yourself to blame. Oh, it's too late. Oh my god. Oh no, it's clapped. Eat him. <gasps> Oh, I'm happy, yes. I told you either Edmund or Aslan had to be the one to kill her. Edmund! Wow. That was the only use for you throughout the whole movie. Lucy has the thing. Come on, there's got to be consequence. I need consequence. I guess, whatever. Kill. Wait. Yeah, she can use that on everyone. Man, this one was one from the start, man. But everyone's alive now. Everyone. I mean, I guess there was that ego that fell into the rock. Like, look at the costume design. Set design. Everything design. Mwah, mwah, mwah. King Edmund, the just. Queen Susan, the gentle. King Peter, the magnificent. <laughs> Edmund gets just, she gets gentle. He gets the magnificent. Of course. <laughs> You're all peasantry. Don't worry. We'll see him again. When? In time. What are you talking about? He's only walking on the beach. How long have they stayed there? Well, they must have been there for like seven years or something. The lamppost. <gasps> Could they not figure out where they came? Could they not figure out how to return home? Because all the ice was gone. Nothing looked recognisable. They're going to turn back to how they used to be. 
Oh, that's so sad. You just wasted like seven years of your life. <laughs> what are you all doing in the wardrobe? You wouldn't believe us if we told you, sir. It's not incest. Don't worry. Try me. This movie was such a joy. It did so many good things right. When it comes to the acting, the music, the set design, the character development, everything was so well done. I'm just annoyed because I feel like it could have been one of the best movies that I've ever seen. Like I know I joke about having deaths and everything, but towards the end it felt like there was no consequence at all. Which is annoying, because if there was, I genuinely think this is one of the best movies I've ever seen. Besides the really dumb humans. <laughs> Nonetheless, still such an enjoyable film. This could honestly be a better first movie than Harry Potter. Do I regret that? I could get cancelled for that. I may need to do a Harry Potter marathon now to refresh my brain. Leave a like if you want to see that. <laughs> Hope you all did enjoy everyone. I'll see you all for the next Sunday Fundy commentary. That sounded really weird. Goodbye!